It's been a difficult few months for the Baker County Fire Department as they responded to two fatal fires, which killed a total of five people, including children. The assistant fire chief says the county's growing population has created challenges for the department and resources are beginning to stretch thin. Riley Phillips is on your side tonight, sitting down with the chief to talk about those challenges and what can be done to fix them. The Baker County Assistant Fire Chief tells me his department is busy responding to more calls than ever before, and they need more resources to ensure they have someone to send when a community member calls 911. Assistant Fire Chief Donald Blanton traded in the bustling city of Jacksonville for a quieter life in Baker County. We moved from Jacksonville out here and um, got us a home with some land and built a little farm. But since taking the job as assistant chief a couple years ago, his time at the fire department has been anything but quiet. Blanton has been helping the department navigate the difficulties of a growing county without growing resources. The fire department operates with nine people a day and they cover more than 500 square miles. But Blanton says there has been a 10 to 15 percent increase in calls for service over the last year, and that sometimes means there is no one to send on a call right away. In the last 24 hours that we we had um, four calls happen in a 20 minute window and one of them was a very serious call where there was multiple victims um, in a car accident. Some had to be actually flown by helicopter out of the county and there was nobody left to even go meet the helicopter with the patients. This plus the distance these first responders often have to drive for a call is troubling for Blanton. We had um, just under a thousand times when we only had one truck in the entire county and we had just under 500 times, so we had no trucks in the entire county, what we call status zero. That means nobody's coming. And uh, that's a tough spot to be in that many times in the course of a little over a year. Blanton says they need more personnel, but that will require more money. While he recognizes every department could use more funds, he's hopeful they can work together with county leaders to provide those extra resources. You want to be able, when somebody dials that number and they have a legitimate emergency, and that's their kid, their mom, their child, whatever, you don't want to know in your mind the whole time you're driving there, I hope our truck frees up. And Blanton says they are doing what they can to find solutions to some of these challenges. They just hired a consultant that will help the department determine what their greatest needs are and what they can do to improve. In Baker County, Riley Phillips, First Coast News on your side.